Dear Marvel, we used to be so close. You were the yolk to my eggs, the yin to my yang, the sloppy to my toppy, but you've changed. I gave you everything, and you just snapped. I gave you my money, I gave you my time, I sank hours into your shitty games, as well as the not so shitty ones. Uh -huh. I even saw all of your films opening night. Hey, no, not you. <laughs> bro, please, bro. I supported you even at your lowest. And this is the thanks I get? This is the best you can do? This isn't the Marvel I grew to love. This quantity over quality mindset has warped your perception of reality. You're selfish, controlling, out of touch. Hold Alas. Hold on. My love now, for you on. is not yet faded. Something keeps pulling me back. Perhaps it's the introduction of the ever-expanding multiverse. Which at this point is like as convoluted as a fucking because Kingdom Hearts you. plot, bro. What the fuck is going no, on? I'm Cause this shit right here, I almost dropped my draws for you, nigga. Oh my god. You can call me the Marvel yeah, Munch, bro. <laughs> Or maybe it's the way you've somehow managed to induct all of Hollywood into the fucking MCU. Never in a million years did I think I would see Angelina Jolie in a Marvel movie, bro, what the fuck. I guess what I'm trying to say is that I'm giving you an opportunity to make things right. Cause this shit right here ain't working, my nigga, goddamn. Hey, yo, what the As of recording this, we are approximately seven days away from the release of Black Panther 2. If you have any heart at all, you'll make this a night to remember. Our relationship depends on it. You've given me valid reason to be hopeful with these beautifully edited trailers. God damn, you done brought Riri back to me. Hallelujah! And, and, and this? Oh my god. Oh my god. But I digress. Do not break the little trust and faith I still have in you. This is your last chance to mend this relationship. Do not fuck this up. What you mean Kendrick not on the soundtrack this time?